from foe to friend. Could the mosquito actually end up being our ally in the fight against malaria? There are thousands from all over the world kept in cages at this insectary at Imperial College London, part of a project called Transmission Zero to genetically modify mosquitoes to kill the malaria parasite within them. You will see that they will start feeding on your hand. So it can't be passed on to humans when they bite. These are uh, exogenous genes that we bring into the mosquito. They are known antimicrobial molecules from other species. For example, one of them we're using is from the honeybee. Right? We need this modification to propagate, to spread, so that every mosquito eventually in Africa, every malaria-transmitting mosquito at least, will carry this. The genes from the honeybee and also a type of frog are injected into mosquito eggs under a microscope. They produce a protein that is toxic to the malaria parasite. Then, with another genetic technique, scientists are able to ensure all the descendants of the mosquito inherit the same ability to kill the parasite. According to the World Health Organization, almost 600,000 people died from malaria in 2023. Most of them were in Africa, three quarters of them were children under the age of five. Bed nets, insecticides, drugs and vaccines are only partly effective and that's why scientists here say they need to try something new. The mosquitoes can't be released until the genetic modification is shown to be safe, but the genes can't be passed on to other insects. So uh, we have to prove in the lab that it works, and it works the way we want it to work. And then we have to prove that it is safe. It doesn't cause any additional harm, uh, any unintentional harm, uh, both to people and the environment. Uh, it is accepted by the communities. Uh, it's accepted by the regulators uh, before we're able to test them in the field. It'll be several years before the technique is perfected and signed off by the regulators. But one day there may be no pills to take, no bed nets to worry about. The mosquito could be doing the hard work to eliminate malaria. Thomas Moore, Sky News at Imperial College in London.